Good afternoon and welcome to Health Hub. I'm Associate Professor Nigel Biggs and I'm the Head of Department in Ear, Ear Nose and Throat Surgery here at St Vincent's Private Hospital in Sydney. Uh, and this afternoon I'm just going to talk a little bit about some of the conditions uh, that you should be aware of that should uh, seek med medical treatment for or attention for uh, should they occur uh, in the current environment. Here at St Vincent's we're doing everything we can to protect our patients and staff and it's a, it's a safe place to attend. Uh, we're uh, undertaking both telehealth consultations and face-to-face -face consultations with our patients uh, uh, depending on the uh, cases as they arise. Uh, so as far as uh, ear, nose and throat conditions that uh, we'd be, uh, want to be aware of uh, should they occur and what we would certainly recommend seeking atten uh, medical attention for would be first of all if there was a sudden hearing loss in one ear uh, should this occur uh, really you need to either see your GP or see an ENT surgeon in a fairly prompt fashion within, within a matter of days. Uh, other important uh, conditions, particularly in relation to the nose, would be persistent bleeding from the nose for more than four weeks, or the new onset of nasal obstruction uh, that hadn't been present uh, before lasting for more than four weeks. We'd certainly recommend that both of those conditions be, be looked at. Uh, and the other conditions as far as the throat that we'd be very concerned about or want people to seek attention for would be perhaps a, a mouth ulcer that had been present for more than four weeks, a lump in the neck that's developed, again if it's been present for more than four weeks, uh, a change in the voice uh, that can't be explained uh, or, or ha hasn't got an apparent cause and that's been present for a number of weeks and certainly if there's any increased difficulty swallowing or pain with swallowing and if that's been present for a number of weeks, that certainly would warrant investigation. Um, if you have any uh, questions about these conditions, um, please don't uh, hesitate to contact us or you could leave questions in the comment uh, box below. Uh, thank you.